Here's a good analogy that might help you remember how enzymes work. Imagine you like a person and you want to form a bond with this person. Theory out there is that the more you spend time with this person, the more you go out with them, the more you send them text messages, the more likely they are to find you interesting and want to form a bond with you. Hopefully they don't find you annoying. But now think of that person as an enzyme and you a substrate. What this simply means is that the more a substrate is exposed to an enzyme, the more or the increase in likelihood of the enzyme substrate complex forming because there's a bond that is formed there. Now think about how competitive inhibition might affect this. In competitive inhibition, there's someone else who also likes this person and that someone else says, I'm just going to do exactly what you do. I am going to expose myself to this person as often as possible. I'm going to text them as often as possible. And because they are able to do that, they are able to form the bond in your place, which means that the person that you like ends up becoming friends with them instead of you. Watch part two.